At gas stations across the country, prices are shooting up higher and faster than they have in more than a decade. YouTube, YouTube, what is going on? I'm your host, Runaway Child, and I'm back at y'all with another one. If you haven't already subscribed, man, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. Now, nah, right now, nah. go ahead and hit that subscribe button. And if you're already subscribed to the channel, man, go ahead and throw a like on this video. A like don't cost you anything to throw on this video. It is for free. So please, show your boy some love. But anyhow, what I wanted to talk to y'all about today was, man, these gas prices. These gas prices is ridiculous. Man, they through the roof. I told y'all that in my last video, or my pre one of my previous videos, I told y'all that they predicting by July it's going to be seven, eight dollars a gallon for. That's for regular fuel. That ain't even for diesel. Well, we're out here running, you know? So I've been having to uh, call these brokers and have some of these prices and stuff uh, readjusted because, you know, you got to take into consideration that the load ain't going to pay what it's normally accustomed to paying with these fuel prices the way that they are, especially if you're running in the mountains. And a lot of y'all truckers, y'all know what I mean. If you're running in the mountains or you're running against that wind, you might want to, this is the time to do some of your pre-trip, pre-planning, -pre uh, weather advisory, all of that kind of stuff before you even book the load because you mess around and you go into some of the wrong spots and you don't book the load for you know a cheap price or what some consider to be a cheap price, you know, you might spend all your money on fuel. You know, that's just the name of the game right now. So I just wanted to give y'all a, a, a quick, you know, take on what I thought about, what I think about, you know, what's going on with these fuel prices and stuff like that. It's kind of hard to say, you know, what I think was going on. And it's kind of hard to say, you know, well, this is happening or this is taking place. I mean, you hear so many things, you hear so much stuff, you know, we don't really know what's going on. How much higher can prices go here? Well, I think it's certainly within the realm of possibility that here very quickly in the next 72 hours, we could see the national average breaking its all-time record high. Food prices are through the roof. I mean, but everywhere I go, people saying that they can't get no help with people working. Anything that touches a truck, commerce, deliveries, groceries, lumber, going to the store, anything that is being shipped via semi-truck is eventually going to get hit. So like, what's going on? Where are people getting money from? Where they get money from the travel because I'm on these roads and all I see is cars on top of cars on top of trucks. Like, where are people getting money from to to fund these adventures and stuff that they're, you know, going on and stuff like that? I mean, because every time you turn around, they say, oh, well, we ain't got no workers or we had to shut down early or the truck didn't arrive or, you know, some crazy odd off the wall stuff. It's like, what is really going on? I don't know. Maybe y'all can fill me in on some of this stuff and, and let me know what y'all think because it's starting to be a little weird, eerie. I don't know. Something is going, something is off somewhere. Something is off somewhere. I have never seen it in this type of condition before. Gotti, just look at those prices behind you. How much could this end up costing families here in the U.S.? Yeah, I'll say just seeing these prices is mind boggling and hopefully people will be able to find cheaper prices. But experts say the way things are going, the average American family may be spending a thousand dollars more in gas than they did last year. I just want to give y'all a quick video, man. Let y'all know, give y'all some updates on Runaway Child. You know what I'm saying? Got a little, had a chance to spend a little time at home. You know what I'm saying? I might insert a little video in here and let y'all see, you know, got a chance to spend a little time with the kids.
ask y'all, what do you think about these fuel prices? What do you think about these fuel prices and this weather? This weather, man, this this weather is 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 throwing numbers out like the Powerball. You know what I'm saying? 66, 13, 25, 48. <laughs> it's crazy. I don't know what's going on, man. But anyhow, thanks for all the new subscribers to Flare Trucking. You know what I'm saying? Without y'all, hey, the channel wouldn't be anything. So thanks for all the new subscribers, man. And y'all keep running the numbers up. Keep running the numbers up, baby. Let's get it up. Let's get it up. But make sure y'all run the likes up, man. That throw my videos into the algorithms to make other people, you know, want to watch these, this type of content. So help your boy out, man. Show some support. Show some love. Shout out to all the supporters that's supporting the channel and that's supporting, you know, the whole Flare brand, the whole Flare gang, the whole Flare nation, you know. But anyhow, check us out, www.flatrucking.com. You can check us out on Instagram, at runawaychild35. You can also hit me on my Gmail, runawaychild35 at gmail.com. If you want to do any promo on the channel, if you got any ideas or anything that you want me to discuss on the channel, hey, let me know. I got people hitting me up all the time. Hey, I think you should talk about this, or hey, I think you should talk about that, or hey, show this, or hey, do that. You know what I'm saying? I got people hitting me up all the time with those type of ideas. So, hey, you be one of those people. Hit me up, man. Let me know. Run away, child. And we are out.